Alright guys, you're back with Big Guy Builders, and uh, today we have a spider transformer. I don't know why these aren't twisted right. There we go. Now you look even more disgusting. Just kidding, he's not disgusting, he's cool. He's a spider. Creepy. Crawly. Let's get into how to transform this. I don't really like this design because it can't stand up as easy as a normal one. I was going to add four legs, I told y'all, but I just was like, eh, just forget about it. But you could, you could add uh, upper hind legs and make them go right here and do the same connecting pieces right there and uh, you can make thicker legs and make them even look cooler. But uh, that's, you can do a lot of posability for this guy. Oh, I forgot to do comparisons on this one. Let's do some quick comparisons. Uh, mini fig and uh, robot. Dead guy, dead man. I don't even know anymore. And uh, robot. So he can just be like nibbling on his remains. Which I love. These are actually really, really sharp Lego pieces because they're pretty new, but I got them out of a, a, another Lego kit. I don't get them too often, just about once a month, or maybe not even that. But I, I uh, picked out my own special pieces my second time, uh, and it was pretty fun. First time this year though. And so yeah, let's get into how to transform this flexible spider. So first you want to go and do this. This is the fun part. Gonna want to stick those together. Now, I am gonna show y'all a little extra fun detail about this guy. <clears throat> oh, this goes back, flips into this little hole. The robot eyes go back as well. These go just like this, like who or something. That's why I say a lot on my, on most of them. Now, if he had four legs, then he could probably stand better. But, uh, let's keep on fixing. Now you want to unsnap this one. Fold back this one. Do all this and that. And voila, you have an arm. Which I really like that. How that's done. And then, like, these come right there. You can either have that or have them like ears or something. I don't know. You might not like that. Uh, but, uh,. That's just a little extra detail, and then I have a really, really cool. I like how this happens because it's like it moves all the arm information, know how to move it back through here and to there, and then it's a bigger, stronger arm. I like that. So yeah, that is my version of Nightmare. It is it's supposed to look more like a robotic um, spider uh, that came out of like a high, like an alien Area 51 or something escaped and um, minifig comparison this mode the 
Oh yeah, and the comparison with this is actually very, very good. Because you can put in him in there. You can put him in here. Just wait one second, guys. There we go. Boop. Oops. Give him a chance. Wow. He really does not want to go in there. Well, it's a transformer. So that's a little extra cool detail. Let's get this all lined up. So, uh, how about a robot comparison right there? Like that. And uh, yeah, he looks pretty cool. Uh, just like I said, he the legs are a trouble, but they, I mean, you're probably going to be doing this all the time, fighting them, because you'd probably play with them a lot. Uh, I don't play with uh, my Lego Transformers a lot, I just like to pose them up and uh, make videos on them, uh, add details. That's basically it. Uh, every now and then I'll play with them. But, uh, that was a, about January, last time I played with them. Probably should play with them again, but, uh, no, probably not. <sighs> so, this is him doing splits, and, uh, yeah. So, he's very flexible, very poseable, even though he can't really stand as good as anyone else. He is a fighter, so you could get a scared little dude right here, see, put him in his mouth, and he's eating him, like so, so yeah, that's basically my review, even though he's not a scorpion, this was inspired by Mindbender, so thank you for that. I also have been inspired by uh, Airblix98 to uh, do some uh, Predacons, which was heavily inspired by the dragon and my insects and bugs. But, um, yeah, I'm probably going to do one of those soon. But I really gotta get to bed. I'm starting to get tired. So I also am building a new construction transformer. Um, so yeah, thank y'all guys for watching. This is Big Guy Builder. Sign off.